we are going to find f prime of x for the function f of x equals the fraction with numerator 2x squared minus square root of x plus 4 and denominator square root of x. We'll go step by step, simplifying first, then differentiating, and finally presenting a clean answer. Step 1. Simplify. First, rewrite square root of x as x to the 1 half. Now split the single fraction into three separate fractions. We'll simplify each term using the exponent rule x to the a over x to the b equals x to the a minus b. For the first term, 2x squared over x to the 1 half becomes 2x to the 3 halves. For the second term, x to the 1 half over x to the 1 half equals 1. For the third term, 4 over x to the 1 half equals 4x to the negative 1 half. So the simplified function is f of x equals 2x to the 3 halves minus 1 plus 4x to the negative 1 half. Step 2. Differentiate term by term. We'll use the power rule. The derivative of x to the n is n times x to the n minus 1, and the constant rule. The derivative of a constant is 0. Differentiate the first term. The derivative of 2x to the 3 halves is 2 times 3, halves times x to the 1 half, which simplifies to 3x to the 1 half. Differentiate the constant negative 1, which becomes 0. Differentiate 4x to the negative 1 half, which becomes 4 times negative 1 half times x to the negative 3 halves, that simplifies to negative 2x to the negative 3 halves. Combine the pieces to get f prime of x equals 3x to the 1 half minus 2x to the negative 3 halves. Step 3. Rewrite using radicals if desired. x to the 1 half is square root of x, and x to the negative 3 halves is 1 over x to the 3 halves, which equals 1 over x times square root of x. So f prime of x equals 3 times square root of x minus 2 over x to the 3 halves. Step 4. Present a single fraction form with a common denominator. The common denominator is x to the 3 halves, which is x times square root of x. Multiplying the first term appropriately and combining gives f prime of x equals the fraction with numerator 3x squared minus 2 and denominator x times square root of x. Because square root of x is in the original denominator, the domain is x greater than 0. Let's box the final answer. Recap. We split the quotient, used exponent rules to simplify, applied the power rule and constant rule, rewrote using radicals, and expressed the derivative as a single fraction. Our final result is f prime of x equals the fraction 3x squared minus 2 over x times square root of x, with x greater than 0. Thank you for watching. Tap like, share, and comment, and then follow and subscribe for more quick problem solving tips. Let's make maths simple. One video at a time, only on MyVerse Maths.